Welcome to the game in itself, people. For goodness sake. There goes my last match. Okay, um, I'll be absolutely honest. This game has been recommended to all of us by my beloved girlfriend. And let's see. She has great taste. For example, look at me. <laughs> she can't watch this because she's deadly allergic to um, horror playthroughs. Because it's a horror game. So let's see. I'm so tired of this place. Wash my sheets, Elise. Swap my floors, Elise. Elise, Elise, Elise. <sighs> I showed them. I make them scrub my posts and pants, my shoes even. Have them wipe down all my windows, every last one. Clean out my heart and fetch me some water. Better yet, I have them running around calling me Miss Elise all day. Uh, if only I were rich. <laughs> True. All the steak I could ever want. All the shiny dresses. One for each day of the week, with shoes and jewels to match. And mates. All the mates I could ever want. Oh, if only. Well, one can dream. At least. Ah, oh, for goodness sake. Oh? There you are, you shameless thief. Give me back all you took. Right? No! Wait, please. Please forgive me. Wait, we have the same eyes. Stop hitting her! Explain yourself, you wretch! Wrench! What are you doing in my house? Hit, hit, hit! Please don't hit me! I just... I was just hiding. There were these men and I... I wanna ask you a second time, thief! Hurry up. Give me back my everything you took right now! I didn't take anything! I was just scared. Please, I beg of you. Show me your hands. I didn't take anything, ma'am. Uh. Well, show me your pockets and make it quick. I uh, keep telling you, I didn't steal anything, ma'am. This is all I have, I swear. Coins and wits. <laughs> what are you doing up here in the mountains? Oh. I'm a traveler, ma'am. Uh. Turn around. You say you're a traveler? Are you all by yourself? Yes, I'm traveling alone. I hope I could rest for the night in this village, but I saw some people walking in the woods. It frightened me, so I ran off to find some place to hide. Ah, uh, be as it may, you're still. Oh, please, forgive me, ma'am. I didn't mean to make such a mess. Would you stop calling me that? I'm sorry. Alright, well. Mm. I might let you go if you can prove your innocence, that is. I don't know what else can I do, ma'am. Well, you can start by cleaning up this mess. And then you can... Ma'am? <gasps> yes, that's it. I made. Right. Listen carefully now. First, you'll be tightening up the mess you've made. In fact, you can clean my whole house from top to bottom. They'll teach you not to go storming into strangers' homes. Sorry, I am, um, ma'am. Complaining already? How are you? Wouldn't you agree this is the least you can do? Yes. Well, of course, I I'll gladly do it, ma'am. <laughs> Good. And in exchange, I suppose you can stay here. But no more tipping. <laughs> I'm not a thief, ma'am. I'll be the judge of that. Thank you very much. Anyhow, you work for me and I'll give you a place to stay. Fair enough, wouldn't you say? It does sound fair, and it's very kind of you, but... I'm not a thief. Fine, you're not a thief. Now, would you stop calling me, ma'am? Do I look like an old hack to you? <laughs> My name is Elise, and you best remember it. I'm, I'm so sorry, I forgot to introduce myself. Who is this one? Salonic Wanderer? Rosenmarine. Oh, what is this? Oh, so pretty! 
Fluffy. Fluffy companion. Why not? Ah, before you go, Elise. Hmm? I have something to tell you. If, um, you could come meet me later today. What's keeping you from telling me now? Um, well, it's important, so... I'll be back by nightfall, right? Oh, for goodness sake. It best be worth my while, you hear? Uh, I promise it's nothing bad. We'll see about that. Oh, the mass. Oh, we have to sit next to this one. Is she pretty? Elise. She's definitely pretty. Good morning, Alice. Evergreen sweetheart for ya. How are you? Always so cheery, Freya. You took so long. I thought you weren't coming. Uh, I always left a little bit, I suppose. I didn't get that much sleep last night. Oh, me neither. And all because of that windstorm. Not even my little spring could help me. Your spring? I keep a tiny spring of lavender under my pillow, you see? Sniffing it helps me sleep better. And I live such a lovely... Shh, keep quiet, you too. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Wilhelm. With best focus now, at least. You. You're the one we're turning on, Freya. <laughs> Another cute one. Lekuhan. <laughs> oh, took you all. Took you. Took you all you had to get out of bed this morning, I wager. Sugary devotee, a left cushion. Okay. Is that another grape? Mysterious note. Oh my god. Is it the devil? Ah, Walpuka, dein Dame, no sé qué. Und deine, no sé qué, alle erreiten, no sé qué, no sé qué. So, Mogi dice, where is my girlfriend when I need her? She's sleeping, that's where she is. Fuch, the Baron. Oh my god, I wish I knew more German. And I also cannot make up the words too well. I'm pretty sure she can, but I can't. There is something written on here. Hello, World Purga. Ah, oh. sanctifies by that. Okay. Hello, Walpurga. San Sanctify be thy name. Ah. Gepilden werde dein Name. Okay, makes sense. May thy will be everlasting and thy grace all embracing. Moge dein Wille immer gereichen und deine, no sé qué, alle. Excite, ex exciten, 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 no sé. Quenched thou shall be on this Sabbath of the full moon. What? May this prayer find this restful place in thy life, beer and grove. A prayer? There's something else at the bottom. Kifeberg's offering lies in the crossroads beyond the maple. May thy thirst be quenched, thy blessings receive. Okay, in the crossroads. Hmm. I wonder who dropped this. I don't know, but what heart? Karen sleep la much last night, could you? Could you? I uh, didn't sleep a wink. Explain. Explain the hilarity. <laughs> You're hopeless, love and Kuhn. Left Kuhn. As long as you keep indulging me. So it's my fault, huh? Here you go, before I forget. Oh, we got a pretzel. We won't die tonight. Oh, you brought me my favorite. Mm -hmm. Mr. Bernhardt said you were rather late to getting home last night. Is that so? I did tell you it was almost time for supper when you stopped by. 
and I told you Mrs. Der Elmer worked me like a donkey right up until nightfall. <laughs> Mr. Bernhard, Bernhard was fretting over you, it's all. Mr. Bernhard can find better things to do with his time, I'm certain. You really are so stubborn, at least. Anyhow, it's about time we head out. Say, I'll be up at the bell tower at all afternoon if you'd like to keep me company. I'll be there, love. Ah, she come by just in time, Alice. You see that little anxious, Miss Elma? Miss Elma? How can I not be with all this rubbish scattered about town? Anyhow, won't you fetch me some apples? Alright, I'll do it. I'll lend your hand, Miss Elma. See that you bring me the absolute right ripest, do you hear? <sighs> Only makes me want to bring her the rotten ones. How many apples do these folks need, anyhow? <laughs> it's raining apples. Hey, there are many games. It's raining apples! Ooh! Wait, 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 wait. How do I? Okay, okay. Oh my god. I can gather a shit ton of apples. Mierda, I picked the prunes. The prunes are not good. Only the apples. Shit. Oh, it's getting faster! Come on, game. Be merciful. I'm not that good. Oh, shit, 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 shit. No, not the prunes. The prunes are good for digestion, but not for the quest. How many did they get? Round two? Okay. I wasn't expecting this one. Did they not get enough apples? The prunes. Prunes are good for digestion, not for the quest. Okay. Prunes help you not to be constipated. Well, they don't want fruits, they want apples only. You know who's this good at? Is extremely good at these kind of games. Or has some gayness. Okay. We have. Oh, rank B. You know the turnable for the first time. I, I wasn't expecting this one. This is so good. <laughs> How much money is? Nah, five money is no way. I'm poor. You pass. Okay, nice. This will do, I suppose. Watch I mean, I gotta be. I will. It, I would better up asking Freya instead, perhaps. Why didn't you ask her then? Uh, well, I will next time. This entitled old hack. <laughs> okay, this is it. There she is. Oh, we're going to lose one food. Yes, this action will skip one time period. I know, I can prepare. I have sp I'll spend some time with her. Oh, <laughs> it was a heart. Okay. Wait, let me have some tea. Porque I prepared the tea and I haven't touched it in a while. It's getting cold. Let me have some tea before we head into the good stuff. Why do I have the odd feeling that something horrible is going to happen now? Oh, Jesus, help me. I'm so weak. <clears throat> My, there was no need to run, Elise. Who's running you? I, I was I was sprinting, but we don't say. <laughs> You're always like this, Lefkuhn. I can't help it. You're so easy to tease, Elise. <laughs> okay, fair is fair. Such a nice day today. I would I could stay here until nightfall. In the mood for another earful from Father Hans, are you? Ah, remember when we would sneak up here at night time? Mm. To look at the stars and snack snack on leftover pretzels? Mm, as if I forget that. Or that night that old geezer caught us. <laughs> You'll never let that one go, will you, Liz? 
That wretch had me on my knees praying for hours on end. Yet all you got was an earful. I recall praying right alongside you that night, don't you? Because you felt sorry for me, not because he told you to. Oh, okay, that's cute. You two will never see eye to eye, will you? What's there to see? You're the one who's put up with him for too long, the way I see it. Oh, it's not as though we've never been at odds with each other. Oh, spare me. How about what? You think I'm short of complaints? Indulge me. Why don't you? <laughs> Paul kisses like you belong in the pig pen, you oinker. I have cooking. <laughs> Sweating. <laughs> because she's not getting in any trouble. The one that's gonna get in trouble is a smart girl. Okay, yes, we made a fine chose. This one, this one. I like this one. <laughs> You'll never hear us from up here, at least. Alright. But you're the one getting the lecture if he catches us. Mm, at the top of your lungs now. You're so ugly, not even Samuel Purga can save you, ogre. <laughs> Dare to tell my hair is too long again, and I'll chop off whatever's left of yours, you old weasel. Did he really tell you that? <sighs> For a clergywoman, that is. What the fuck? Who cares about some made-up rules, Lev? Aren't you feeling a lot lighter after all that, Elise? I can't see why you needed it, that's for sure. I'm not I'm not saint after all, despite my fail. It's a shame you don't let your hair down more often, Lev. Okay. Okay, I'm... I'm having thoughts. I think I'm having too many thoughts. I think I know where this is heading to. And this is it is wonderful. It suits you much better than than that dust cloth on your head. My you're such charmer at least. All it does is weigh you down and it makes you look gloomy too. How do I look without it then? Beautiful. You're such a kill your love good. Anyhow, at least it's best we move along, wouldn't you say? Uh, those eggs won't collect themselves, I suppose. I'll be waiting for you by the baker later, don't forget. Of course, love. I'll be there. Leave is Leave it. Leave is device. Hard piece acquired. Okay. I have no idea. Something about love. <laughs> Daytime. There she is. I'll spend some time with her. We're getting home, huh, Rose and Marine. I didn't know you'd be back so soon, Elise. Huh. I still, I still all the way head back to town, mind you. What are you doing standing out here? I'm <laughs> uh, just waiting for the stars to come out. It's home. Hmm. A little too early for the stars, don't you think? I find it helps me, helps me air my odd at that. Whatever is that there. Are your thoughts out, you say? I'm waiting for the waxing crescent. It's um, important I'd set my sight on what's to come. The sooner the better. What do you mean, Rosemarine? You see, Elise. I've dreamt about you before. About Kifaber, too. Oh? Last night, or...? <laughs> I know this may sound strange, but... I didn't quite stumble upon Kieferberg by accident. What do you mean? Do you believe in fate, Elise? Mm, mayhaps. I don't know. I've never given it much thought. Then you most likely won't believe what I have to say, but... Oh, I've always known my fate was with you, Elise. Okay, now I'm feeling terrible. Uh... It's too soon to be having this conversation, if I'm honest. I mean, to wait until you were ready, but, um... I don't understand, Ros Rosenmarine. Ready for what? You'll know in time. For What's with all this mystery? I'll admit it, Rosenmarine. What are you trying to tell me? It took me quite some time to make sense of it myself, but... 
everything is feeling so strangely nostalgic to me. Nostalgic, you say? Your name, your voice, your home, this breeze even. All that surrounds you. So much of it feels like home to me. Uh, that's not possible, was it, Marine? It's you the star told me about, Liz. I'm certain now. Never in my life have I heard such nonsense. And yet, I'm covered in ghost bumps. <laughs> I can tell you don't believe one word of what I just said. Rose and Marine, I... I think I'll stay out here for a little while longer. If that's alright. I promise I won't be late for supper. There's nothing for supper, honey. Alright. Don't stay here too long, are you here? I won't, I won't. Okay. Oh? What is Was this opening here before? I wonder. This place is so stuffy. Stay sane. Keep Elise from feeling frightened with sanity healing items, or she might go mad. Okay. Oh, fucking delicious. We might go insane. Item get acquired. One diary entry number one. This looks an awful lot like that old geezer's robe, doesn't it? What is it? What's this? The miracle of our beloved patroness, Saint Walpurga. After last evening's events, I have no choice but to take responsibility. Not only for Saint Walpurga's sake, but for old Hall as well. What? Huh? Ooh, look at this facial expression! It's so good! I don't know who... I don't know the team, I don't know the people who work on these illustrations, but my congratulations just for this expression. It's so good! Granny Hall? On her deathbed. Old Hall confessed to all her sins among her most mundane missteps. She told me of this, of her many prayers to cure her of her chill childlessness. Yet what struck me as, a, as remarkable was the miracle she claimed was granted, that the woodland itself granted her wish for a child, as she put it herself. He granted her wish for a heavy price. How can this be? What did all Hall truly mean to say? If this truly did happen, and Elise was conceived by Saint Walpurgis' divine intervention, yet, if not for Saint Walpurgis' blessing, then who is he? All Hall didn't seem delirious, nor did she lose her composure. I have more questions that I can answer at this moment. What is going on here? I best hold onto this piece of paper. Definitely. Oh, we're going insane already. I don't get tattered no note. This? this is the barn, isn't it? Another prayer? Hello, Walpurga. Sanctify thy, be thy name. I beg thou for a sign, a testimony to my plea. May you accept this offering, remnants of thy miracle. Give up thy welcomes, thy blessings, thy guidance. Someone must be leaving this around, but who? There is something else at the bottom. Find proof of our fate up at the peaks. Buried within the windmill that once was. This is... That old windmill up in the mountains. Muffy? What in the Lord name are you doing here, me Uh what's that struggle this is where I swear on my auntie's name. And you just so happened to hide behind my house, I see. Who doesn't? You sneak about folks homes every now and then to join you. What are you doing here, Maddie? Tell me right now, I'll scrub your mouth so this very minute. I think it's getting quite late, isn't it, Alice? I best. Ah, I saw her. And that, that girl in your house, Annalise. You saw nothing, Molly. She, she's not from around here. Even I can tell. 
We are having supper together and and everything, Elise. You keep your mouth shut, Mubby, or I'll... Why don't you share some of that bread you've got, Elise? I might keep quiet if you do. Oh, I should have guessed that's what you wanted. Brew, where's, where's my pan? I don't have enough pan. Give. If I hear as much as a word about this, Molly. Oh boy, oh boy. Come on, the Elise. Why don't you bring me a pretzel tomorrow? What? Mouth shut, I'll throw you in the well. Oh, we accidentally got to bed. Look at us, we're so cute. We have such nice eyebrows. For goodness sake. What am I getting myself into? First, I agreed to house Rose and Marine. Now, Mephis got wind of it too. I best make sense of these all by tomorrow. If only I could leave this town. Go somewhere far, far away from here. A place where I never had to fret about money or going hungry. Like a castle or a palace. Somewhere. Where can I live? Where I can live the life I deserve. Let's turn off the camera. Huh? I have a bad feeling about this. Me too, if I'm being honest. Okay. Alright. What? In the Lord's name is this place? What are those? Things. This is it. it worked. Okay. Okay. We didn't die. Oh, is this the end of the demo? What is this? Where am I? I must be dreaming. Wait, do I have to walk? Oh, I can walk. Him. What's here? The castle? Wait a second. There is a tale. I'm not going to go into details. Uh, but there is a tale that talks about candles of life. And see these candles in different stages of uh, having been worn. Used to. Uh, spent. I don't know what's the birth. For that, um... Kind of reminds me of that, of that castle. What is that? Is this about reincarnation? Have we been reincarnating over and over again? Harry, <laughs> what's this? Harry now, Harry now, we're late for his banquet. What are you? Harry, Harry. <laughs> Who's banquet? I mean, I don't want. Not to worry about money and food, but... Okay. She's running by herself. More pumpkins? Okay. Alright. Alright. I've neglected this for so long, it'll be impossible to dig. <laughs> Anyhow, let's no time to loiter about. How do we dig? How do we? I want to farm. I want to farm. Hmm? What is this? What's this? A pair of shoes? <gasps> How could they have possibly wound up here in my garden? Oh, they're wonderful. And they fit me like a glove, too. These shoes. Oh. 
It's as though they were made for me. Maybe they were, sweetheart. Maybe they were. Oh! All of Kiefebrag needs to hear about this. What happened to the garden, Alice? 